Now, I wanted to give an update on my one-year anniversary using the Steam Deck. And I think a lot of you out there have been wondering, should I get one of these or is it just a pass? And I'm not going to sit here and tell you that this handheld is perfect because it's not. However, up until this point, we've never really seen anything like it before. And what makes this Steam Deck different than any other handheld right now that came before it is that it can handle console and PC games close to perfection. I mean, the performance of you know running these games is really close to perfect. Now, sure, the screen is going to be a lot smaller than using a PC monitor or TV, but still, it's 7.4 inches. It's still very good. And there are some competitors to the Steam Deck right now, such as the Lenovo Go Legion and the Asus ROG Alley, but the deck is just different. It also has the Steam Store, which in my opinion makes the whole handheld console purchase worth it. You know, the Steam Store has thousands of titles that can be played on the deck, some of which come up as verified to work with it, and some that say unverified. But even the unverified games work fine, and this is from my own experience playing a lot of these games. Currently, the deck comes in two different models. You've got the LCD and OLED, and the price range for either of them is still well under $1,000. And as far as gig sizes, I would recommend going with at least the 512 gig because that's going to get you plenty of games before running out of space. And you could always buy an SD card for extra space later on, which is, you know, a huge benefit to using this handheld. But, you know, here's my opinion on if buying a Steam Deck is worth it or not. You know, on average, and this is for me, I probably spend about an hour a day using it. For some of you, it might end up being a lot less, but I would also look at owning one of these as an investment because you're likely going to be using it for at least three years, if not more, because it's not like, you know, a new Steam Deck is going to come out every single year like phones do. You know, it's it, they release a lot less. Uh, you can also take it with you when you're on the go for travel or really for wherever you want to game inside your house, but not exactly sure where you want to sit down it's very versatile like that there are also so many cool games to play it right now and one of them i can't get enough of is street fighter 6 you know i absolutely love this game so i wanted to put in some work for it for you guys and do a little gameplay after i'm done with that I'm going to do a little Batman Arkham Knight, which is another great game. Of course, if you guys would like to learn more about the Steam Deck, as far as deals are concerned, there will be some great resources you can check out directly below in the description. You could also get on our Steam newsletter, where we send out one email a week on updates, new releases, and reviews. Don't forget to tap that like, and let's get into some of this gameplay. Yeah! <laughs> 
Now, before we get more into this, I wanted to recommend you guys check out Ignition Poker. You know, I think most of us enjoy playing poker in our free time, and this is a great place to do just that. I've currently been playing on Ignition for the last seven years and regularly tear things up at the mid-state games. They've got amazing software for playing on your phone or PC and also offer you the ability to play both free and real money games. And with lots of cash games running 24 hours a day and millions of dollars in monthly tournament prizes, you should be asking yourself, what am I doing here? I need to check out Ignition Poker ASAP. Of course, if you guys would like to learn more about them, there will be some bonus and resource links for them directly below in the description of this video. overrun. We don't step...
Oracle. Check the chemical analysis I've just done. Sure. Is this what I think it is? Scarecrow's new toxin. An uncontaminated sample. You're not kidding. I'll prepare a full chemical breakdown on the back computer. What? Scarecrow's got a safe house near... Let's hope this is the... This is the place. I should check the penthouse on the top floor. 